What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Mr. Ranamir, welcome back to the channel. I hope everyone's staying safe. Two quick things. One, thank you ever so much for the support in the last video. Giveaway, 1st of December. Video will be launched then. Most you're going to have to do is comment on the video. That's about it. Number two is, don't you just hate it when people put their wings in your face? <gasps> no, I'm only joking. Okay, so today's video is going to be about uh, defending your castle, is to say. I do a lot of videos about this. For those of you who are new here, feel free to go and check out my other videos regarding... Uh, it's, uh, a few of them are called It's a Poor Man's Guide. I'm the poor man, as to say, and I'm defending my castle. Poor Man's Guide to Defending Your Castle and uh, Guard Set. You'll see them on the channel. If you haven't joined the Discord group, come over and join us. There's a few of us over there. We're always chatting about the game, etc., etc. Now, I have a guard set on my Selma that I stand by, put my channel by, as to say. Um, you know, I, I would never change my mind about making this set. And I've made videos along the way. I've got Battle Report for you guys today with big thanks to somebody. I want to shout them out as well. Um, you know, I like to do little science tests on my castle. Give me a bit of an idea about where I'm at with my stats. Um, you know, and uh, it's, it also helps, I say helps with your self-confidence, you know, if you know that your castle can take a hit or you've got confidence in your stats, that's just one less worry on KVK, do you know what I mean? Obviously rallying and stuff like that, and I will state, I'm a very low spender, 5 to £10 a month, if that sometimes. I'll probably spend more on skins recently than anything else due to the 99p ones. But that's my guard set. It's on halt, it's costing a... A fortune in evolution stones at the moment 40% success rate which is about 10% in Clash of Kings terms um, so it's on hold feel free to laugh my main set right not even at plus 6 took a big hit um, uh, yeah not impressed with that but that's why I put it on hold because I'm now focusing on my main set so do not forget that people why I've gone to the auction okay guard set and defending your castle and also Big shout out to Kier here. Thank you. Thank you, mate. I know I'm an ass. I have been a bit of a bit of an ass in this kingdom, but uh, for certain reasons. But you know, these guys, these guys treat me with a lot of respect, and I've got nothing but respect in return. So big shout out to Kid. Thank you so much for helping me today. Okay. So, like uh, things I like to do in this channel, like I said, is do uh science test reports, right? And I do not hide my stats. I've got nothing to hide. This is just a game. I really couldn't care less what anyone says to me in-game. It goes straight over my head, in one ear and out the other. Um, so, you know, I like to show you guys my stats and say to you, this is where I'm at. It's possible. Anything you want to know, again, my stats are far from impressive. But if there's anything that I can help you guys out with, please let me know. If there's a, a percentage of a particular, uh, you know, stat or a plus of something and you want to know what that is or how to get that point out in my comment section or in the discord mail me in game and i will do the best i can to make a video explaining exactly how to get that particular stat and again I'm, my stats far from impressive if i was to get rallied by some big spinners out there i've no doubt that they will fuck me up I won't sit here on a pedestal, trust me. Okay, so these are my stats. And again, big shout out to Kid for helping me do that today. Bear in mind, it's not KBK. It ain't, uh, this was done like 50 minutes ago. Um, you know, or, sorry, an hour ago. You know, there's no C stats here. And I've got an awful lot more science bang on top of this for KBK and also C and Ancient Battlefield and all that bullshit as well. So this is just like a standard science test do you know what i'm saying okay and you know for those of you who are interested those are fully my stats and i'm at what's that 227 254 we're heading in the right direction <clears throat> i'd like to get to like 270 240 that's sort of my next marker but truth be told science and stuff like that is um it's becoming fairly expensive but it's more about the time as well the amount of time that some of it takes to do but you pick a lot of it up over in your civilization temple, which is sort of what I'm trying to get to at the moment. Okay. What I wanted to talk to you about was this particular stat tier. The guard set, which I want to discuss about. Um, and also how to get this infantry defensive damage. Not just on your infantry, but on your archer, cavalry, and siege. Show you how to get it. If you didn't know how to get that, 
I will also show you another little tip as well that maybe some people don't know about. So about how to improve those stats. Not only just that, but I also want to talk to you about the next section down, as you can see here, where I've got uh, do 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 a little Batman um, improving the effect to bigger circle of countering infantry 11 and currently 8%. Not high stats, but when I compare that to some other people's that I see out there, um, not talking about this particular battle report, but like I'm thinking to myself, why are you not working on that? It's a very, very important stat. Very important stat for all of your troops. Um, if I show you my um, do 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 do, let's take the report. Okay, infantry is at eleven and reduce the effect is at eight. Cavalry nine, as you can see down here, nine percent reduce the effect of being counted by seven. So if I can get that both of them above ten, that'll be great. Um, do to do, do archer is not on here. Did he send any archers? If he didn't send any archers, then I doubt there will be the stat on the report. And it does appear. Oh, what? What? Am I going blind? Reduce effective encounter carry. Uh, and reduce. Unless I'm having a funny five minutes. On, I, see the, I see the siege engine, three and two. Anyway, I'm not going to let that hinder me on the video. But I'll show you my archer. Archer commander. That's good, because that's the wrong fucking one, mate. That should be in there. Okay, that explains that. What a twat I am. Why is that in the... I don't know. Anyway, it's at 4.6 and 2.7. As you can see there on the right-hand side. That's highly annoying. Anyway, that's annoying because that wasn't on for the fucking battle report. Kicking myself now. You can't see me, but I am kicking myself. Okay, so obviously talking about the defensive. Over on your infantry commanders. Now, there are two. You get the purple and you get the gold. It does not happen with the purple. You really want to be aiming for the gold. There are events and you can actually unlock this. these commander heroes. Actually very easy. Talking to you from a, a very low spender point of view here. <clears throat> and basically what I've done is this. Pop that on there for the improved effects of countering infantry and pop that on there for a reduce the effect of being countered by infantry. Very obvious. I've made videos about this before. I'm not going to talk about it too much. I just backed off the hero. The skill is what a lot of people tend to not really look at and also the attribute of the hero which i'm going to do next tightly armored infantry current infantry defensive damage 2.75 percent i need one more actually for 99p i can get one more hero badge and upgrade that by another 2.5 percent it takes 10 badges but that is not the full three percent that's only 2.75 so there's a little bit more that you guys may not realize about. So before I show you that, I just want to mention, and again, a lot of people may already know this. It's exactly the same process. Remember, do your gems on your hero. Ignore the other equipment on here. It's just random. Um, and again, impregnable. Increase archer defensive damage 1.5%. Add a star. It is 6,000 to unlock the first slot. And then 10, is it relics or whatever they are, hero badges from then onwards to... 0.25% on top of that itself. Again, same process for the Siege. Don't forget your gems. I've got some fatties on there. I'm not a Siege player, so funny. Uh, and on your skill, as firm as a rock, current Siege engine defensive damage 1.5%. Add the star like so. So for those of you out there who didn't know where that same stat came from, that's exactly where it comes from. Now, my little tip to you is what a lot of people may not realize is over in your attributes for these particular heroes and exactly the same process for all four of your heroes, infantry, cavalry, archer, siege, you will see over here, as you can see, my first locked stat is infantry defensive damage, 0.56%. I know that doesn't seem a lot, but that's what brought me up to over three. You see what I'm saying? So if I can unlock another 2.5%, 
that's at 3.5% now, get another 0.5. It slowly pushes these up, but these extra little stats here and there just play a big part in the battle. You know, just take my word for it, is all I can say. If you're curious on how to get those particular stats or that particular stat, on the information down here, down list of attributes, it will show you down the bottom here. Infantry defensive damage, not only that, but into infantry offensive damage. So if you are an offensive player and you are watching this video, exactly the same process of how to get the offensive damage, smash the enemies, the next star down, infantry offensive damage, 1.5. Come over here to your attributes, potentially unlock it. Another thing that I will also mention for those of you who don't see it, right in front of you. I'm trying to do a... I'm really bad at this. Siege Engine video. I know, bro. I'm awful. I know, I know, I know. Okay. Fuck, it's not going to let me edit it. You bugger. Hold on two seconds. Okay, we are back. Apologies about that. I, I want to be trying to be specific because sometimes I can sort of ramble on and not specifically show you what I'm talking about. So in your attributes, now I, I actually circle, I say circles, three of them. Reduce the effect of being countered by infantry and improve the effect of countering infantry. The third one is reduce the crit damage received by that particular troop. I also think that is potentially quite important in this game uh you know especially uh, it seems like we're, we may be going into a bit of an an archer era maybe potentially archers are still good don't get me wrong especially defending your castle but um archers do a lot of crit damage t12 uh, you know and the new ones as well and if you have a look at the battle report you'll see that my because i'm a, sort of an infantry player my infantry um, crit damage taken is at 75% at the moment. A reduction, that is. So I always think that that's important because obviously that reduces the crit damage that your troops take in battle at the end of the day. If you don't know what crit damage is, Google it. Um, basically, it's a higher amount of damage. You know, you get a certain amount of chance of like, you've got one in 10 chance of critting someone, you're basically going to crit them one in, you hit them 10 times, and then on the 10th hit, or one in 10 chance of doing higher amount of damage on that particular, you know, attack itself. Probably not a great explanation, to be fair, but if you play League of Legends, you'll understand, or any sort of game like that, you'll fully understand what crit damage is all about, and crit damage reduction, which is why I, I do play, and um, it totally means a lot of sense to me. <clears throat> so, as from that itself, I hope, without dragging the video for too long, that's covered a lot of those sort of stats, improving the effects of troops, defensive damage. Again, talking about the guard set, if you are interested in picking it up, it is free. I I think I've spent five quid, actually, on mine to just to complete the last piece. But on events, I will show you. Do, do, do. He says, looking around. There's an event on where you just randomly do shit in your castle and, and get, like, free stuff. I don't do this. Where is it? It's just... I know. 50 cakes. That's what it, that's what I'm looking for. Where are they? Aha. Aha, he says. Here they are. Down here on the bottom <clears throat> is your guard set. <clears throat> Excuse me. Blah, blah, blah. And this will rotate many, many times. You can also get a royal set here, which I suggest you do pick up if you've got enough. But you can just basically go through and pick it all up for free. Synthesize it up to a higher amount. I've made videos on doing this. Feel free to go and check them out. My guard set was free. Upgrading it was basically free to a certain point. Um, but I suggest you consider it. If you're already invested in Archangel set, don't sidetrack. Focus on the task at hand is what I'm saying to you at the end of the day. But I stand by this set. There's also other you know skills. I mean, like... You need to do a lot of skills on heroes. Maybe I'll talk about that on another video. My attributes on this particular hero are all maxed out as well. Defensive damage. Again, infantry defense and attack that I went for because I am a kind of an infantry player, as to say. But uh, yeah, other than that, big shout out to Kid. Thank you again for helping me out. Any questions, queries about the video, slap a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe. 
again, also, if there's anything on my particular battle report, like, you know, a stat or whatever it may be that you'd like to know how to get or how I got that or whatever, pop it in the comment section. I, I am here to help you guys out. This is why I talk on my channel and I don't just fucking play dubstep music in the background or some shit like that, you know. I hope by me talking through things, sometimes rambling on, admittedly, but it makes it an awful lot, you know, simpler for you guys to uh, understand. I'm Mr. Random. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Stay safe and I will catch you peeps later.